Remember the last time you drove somewhere new without a GPS? That feeling of printing out directions, studying a map, creating a mental picture of the route? For many of us, that feels like a lifetime ago. Today, we just type in a destination and blindly follow the voice from our phone. It's incredibly convenient. But have you ever noticed that after arriving, you have almost no memory of how you got there? You couldn't drive it again without help. It's like you were a passenger in your own car. Your brain was never really engaged in the act of navigating. This is more than just a quirky side effect of modern technology. It's a powerful, real-world example of a phenomenon that scientists are growing increasingly concerned about. It's the idea that when we don't use parts of our brain, they begin to weaken, just like a muscle. This is called disuse atrophy. And as we begin to hand over more and more of our thinking to artificial intelligence, the question becomes terrifyingly relevant. Are we heading towards a future where our most critical cognitive skills atrophy? The evidence is starting to pile up, and it points to something far more profound than just a poor sense of direction. It suggests that our relationship with technology is fundamentally rewiring the very structure of our minds. To understand why relying on AI could be a problem, we first need to understand a core principle of our biology, neuroplasticity. Share this video if you found it interesting. Please subscribe to the channel for future videos that deal with the relationship between AI tools and humans. Thanks for watching.